Hi, my name is Sean Jones, adjunct professor here at uh, Argosy University. Today we're discussing managerial accounting formulas. Uh, there are two formulas. While there are several others that we could talk about, there are two main formulas that I want to discuss today. The first uh, is being able to calculate contribution margin uh, within a given company or organization. It's a simple formula, but it simply takes the sales over a given period of time, whether that be a week, a month, or a year, less variable, variable costs, uh, which you then are able to come up with a number which can be also calculated into a percentage. Variable costs are those costs uh, which a business incurs based upon its sales. So for example, if I sell X amount of widgets, I am going to have X amount of costs for producing um, that certain product uh, that our company um, is producing. Contribution margin then flows in them being able to calculate our company's break-even point. Um, or in other words, what is the amount of money um, our, or the amount of sales that our company needs to establish in order to break even. That is calculated uh, by first being able to determine the fixed cost of the given company or organization. This includes um, any payments that are made for property, plant, equipment, um, salaries that go in uh, to running the organization, anything that is the same amount that is paid from month to month is known as a fixed cost. You take that number and then divide that by the contribution margin which we established earlier. Um, from that you're able to come up with your company's break-even point or the point of sales which the company needs to have for it to be able to make a profit thereafter. For more information about this topic, uh, please visit our website, argosy.edu. Um, there you can find uh, our phone number or an address to come and visit our Salt Lake City campus.